Hello everybody. Uh, one of my first videos was how to code BMW E90 uh, with uh, with some apps from Google Store. So one of the apps was Carista. You can uh, uh, diagnose your car, you can code your car. All you need is OBD adapter. So uh, I noticed in my comments that some of you have problems in connecting a car with uh, app. So uh, I think some of you might have problems with uh, OBD adapter. But I also said that I'm going to do everything step by step how to, uh, for example, code a car or uh, or how to uh, diagnose is there any error codes or something like that so let's do it first thing you need to do is put your key in in, in a car some of you ask me do I, the, do I need to start a car no you don't need to start a car you don't need it then you need to plug in OBD adapter I hope you can see it I already plugged it in Okay, now we're gonna go in the app. Sorry, I I'm filming with my other phone, so I hope you will see everything. Uh, okay, this is the app called Carista. Yeah, this second app, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna film in another video about how this Beamer code working. That's gonna be my next video. Okay, let's go to Carista. Uh, from here. Uh, I already connected my adapter with this app, so uh, if if you're connecting the first time at the beginning on screen it will show you uh, how you want to connect, Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, and you need to change, text, uh, press Bluetooth, and it will find automatically this OBD, and it will remember, it, it won't ask you again when you next time connect your car, OBD to your car. It's gonna second second time when you connect it. It's gonna show it like this. So let's say you wanna uh, customize your car. By the way, uh, if your car is above under uh, two thousand and eight, I think or seven year under that, I'm not sure that you can customize your car. You need to go to Carista website. They they will uh, tell you. Uh, supported cars for this app you know my car is 2008 year okay and now we go to customize now it's connecting uh with my car through this obd adapter okay let me see i'm gonna zoom in so remember you don't need to start the car Okay, while it connecting, I can talk about some some features. I don't know. I notice uh, lots of when you if you buy it, uh, OBD adapters from eBay or uh, Amazon or uh, let's say Alibaba. I don't know. Have you heard AliExpress? Have you ever uh, buy some some stuff from them? Uh, there are some fake adapters, you know. So, oh, oh, okay. There are some fake adapters. So maybe I would say 70% wrong adapter. You need to buy a new one adapter. Okay, let's see. Uh, we have doors, windows, remote, instrument, display, lights. Let's say we want to call something in a light, with, with a light. Daytime running lights enabled. Let me say if there is double hazard, how do they call it here? There is anything. Wait, wait, wait. Like you said, see, I already called something. Use front turn signals as living home lights. Yes, turn on gradually. It has, yes, turn it on uh, immediately, you know. Yeah, let's see. You have it like this. You press it, you have, yeah, turn on immediately. Yes, turn on gradually or no. But I'm going to go back. I want to code. 
wait where is it how does it called yeah double impulse hazard lights I want to enable it so I uh, do that and I go to enable and save so it's coding that's the only only you need to do and that's it let me test it I'm gonna test it right now let me see Look. Okay, let's see. Next thing. Uh, coding with this app is so easy. I didn't believe that it, it could be that easy. I thought it's going to be complicated. and But for now, they are really good. Yeah, this is not uh, how to say sponsored video by the way so if there is something wrong with this app i would tell you don't worry about that yeah you can also code uh angelized brightness let's see they they having uh, 11.7 volts 12.2 or 13 volts 13.7 so i'm not sure is it safe to code on on higher voltage so I leave it like this uh, I don't want to burn my angel eyes <laughs> I saw in some on some YouTube videos uh, people who making videos about coding they said it's one it won't it won't arm Wait. they said it won't arm uh, your angel eyes bulbs but nah I don't want to do it for now let's say what do they have on doors windows so they have what is this comfort access enabled of course if you have comfort access on your car out of fold side view mirrors uh, you can also code that but on my car I don't have electric powered windows you mean I mean when uh, you I don't know can, do you understand me what I'm saying I don't have here electric powered so they they closed when I want so I can't code this but you have a powered power folding windows then you can code it unlock fuel door fuel fill door when driver's door is unlocked you can also uh, when all doors are unlocked let's see when you go uh, if you got error code on your car and you're wondering what you need to do what's happening just go to diagnose it will take some time to to diagnose everything, but but after all, it it give you everything, man. Uh, you get error code and explanation. If there is no explanation, you can feel feel free Google it, and you will have your answer. Where is the problem with your car? Let's see. Do I have some co error code? Yeah, my next video. Uh, I was asking to make a review of application Beamer code and I said I'm gonna do it it is gonna be my next video to be true I I didn't I didn't uh, test it I, I bought it I didn't test it so I don't know how it works we will see I hope you see my phone, my second phone when I'm filming. Fifty five percent.
after this video, after I see if there is any error on this app or not, uh, I'm gonna unplug my OBD adapter just to show you that I'm using the old one. When I make my old video, I was using the same OBD adapter, so I, I don't know uh, where could be a problem if you guys can't connect it with your car. Yeah, this app Carista is available on App Store, I mean Google Store, but I'm, I'm not sure I'm using Android phone, so I, I think it's also uh, available for iPhones. So, I think, I'm not sure. And if you don't buy full version, uh, you won't be able to, uh, for coding, you can only diagnose. Yeah, this is this is uh, one question for Carista. If people from Carista are watching me, why don't you make dark mode? <laughs> dark mode would be also great for this app. And you guys are doing great job with this app. Yeah, everything for me. This is everything. I don't think Beamer Code can can beat this app, but we will see. And yeah, uh, I'm using this phone only for my car, for coding, nothing else, for diagnose. And I always put it, oh, oh wait, zero faults, nice. If you have some, co uh, for example, error codes, it will ask you maybe, for example, five error codes and under that it will say one error code, second, third, fourth, what, what error codes you have. And that's it. And on, on, on the bottom of screen, it will have erase codes or, or or I think it will have only erase code. Yeah, erase code. Okay. That's it. I'm going to exit now. And I'm going to show you what adapter. How does it go? Wait. So this is this is the adapter I'm using. ELM327 mini interface Bluetooth. I, I saw that there is some some Wi-Fi element ELM adapters. I didn't use it, but this is Bluetooth adapter. On my first video of this coding, I think I put a link from where I bought it. Anyway, guys, I hope I explain. I hope I explain. Uh, wait, I hope I explain everything uh, on my video how to code a car, and I hope you will make to connect. I I hope you will you will connect your car with uh, Carista. If not, just text me. Put some comments. I'm gonna. We go, we're gonna figure it out how to solve it. Anyway, guys, see you and stay home, guys. Stay home. These times are crazy. Stay home. Bye bye.